Alma College is a co-ed, four-year, residential, undergraduate, private, liberal arts college. Alma College is accredited by the Higher Learning Commission. The college enrolls 1,435 undergraduate students from 24 states and 17 countries. 17.1% are students of color and or international students. The student to faculty ratio at Alma is 12 students for every one faculty member. The college grounds consist of 128 acres with 27 major buildings plus 200 acre ecological tract. The Wilcox Center encompasses the medical center, counseling and wellness services, along with the nursing faculty offices. The nursing department is located on the east side of the Wilcox building. The academic secretary, Julie Ellenboss, is located in the front reception area. Each faculty member has a private office to work and meet with students. The conference room is used for meetings and presentations. It is equipped with a high definition television, DVD player, and hardware and software to project slideshows and videos on the television. The medical center employs a full-time registered medical assistant and a nurse practitioner. Students can seek medical outpatient care, care for acute and chronic conditions, referrals, physicals, and immunizations. The center is affiliated with MidMichigan Health. Appointments can be made or walk-ins are accepted with COVID-19 restrictions. The Wilcox Medical Center includes counseling and wellness lobby where students can enter to wait for appointments. The Hogan Center encompasses many different classrooms and offices. It also serves as a large purpose to athletics. The Hogan Center is home to the Art Smith Arena, which is used for many athletic competitions, commencement, and state-of-the-art fitness and training room. Hogan Classroom 228 is a common room used for nursing classes. The room is equipped with desks that seat up to 40 people. The classroom has technology that is equipped for presentations, lectures, and group work. The area provides adequate lighting and comfort for student learning purposes. The McIntyre Center for Health Science houses the Integrative Physiology and Health Science Department, as well as exercise physiology and electrocardiogram equipment in classrooms. MCE Room 104 is the cadaver laboratory where students have the opportunity to study human anatomy with peers through actual dissection of a cadaver. MCE Room 111 is the classroom in which physiology courses are held. The Dow Digital Science Center provides highly advanced research opportunities with state-of-the-art data collection and analysis. The center is funded by the Herbert H. and Grace A. Dow Foundation as part of an e-STEM initiative geared to promote STEM education and address the national demand for more graduates trained in STEM-related fields. The Dow Digital Science Center includes several theater-type classroom where science courses such as pathophysiology and pharmacology are held. The Dow Building also has many laboratories in which the lab portions of science courses are conducted. The Swanson Academic Center is home of the Provost Office, Dow Media Center, faculty lounge offices, and classrooms. The area is designed for students to have access to technology, administration, along with classrooms and a foyer for learning and communication to occur. SAC 110 is a common classroom for nursing courses. It is designed to hold about 40 people, comfortable desk style seating, and a well-lit workspace. The room has several windows that let natural light in and assist with well-lit workspace. The technology in the classroom is designed for presentations, lectures, group work, and virtual classes if needed. The Tyler Van Dusen Campus Center is the home of the student life offices. The residential nature of Alma College is an important part of the educational experience. Through its facilities, staff, and programs, Alma's residential community seeks to provide a personal living and learning environment in which learning extends beyond the classroom and student activities and organizations provide opportunities for social interaction and personal growth. The CSO provides both support services and access to practical experience that enhance the student's education. They show students how to succeed in the classroom with individual tutoring services, help with writing assignments, and supplemental instruction for various courses such as chemistry, anatomy, physiology, and pharmacology. The CSO offers workshops on a variety of topics regularly throughout the term. 
Some of the general topics include time management, note taking, study skills, test taking, organization, learning strategies, and stress management. The Center for Student of Opportunity also assists students as they plan their personal venture, an individual experience that could take them across the globe. In fact, all nursing students travel to international locations, such as Costa Rica, Ecuador, and Peru in the spring after their junior year to experience global health care in the required course Nursing 360, Global Community Nursing. Students are eligible to receive up to $2,500 in a venture grant to fund this travel. In addition, the Center for Student of Opportunity teaches students important financial skills that position them for personal success while also giving them the chance to serve others. They help student plan for life after ALMA, such as assistance with preparing resumes, but also aid them in becoming a responsible leader. Put simply, the CSO is where it all comes together for students. One of four dormitories, Newberry Hall, was completely remodeled three years ago. Newberry Hall is a part of the sophomore year experience, which houses half of the Alma College second year students. Students living in Newberry Hall have access to several shared amenities located on the first floor. This includes a community kitchen, laundry room, and lounge space with 60-inch televisions. For a quieter place to study, students enjoy the use of the study room off the main lobby. Each floor also features a central lounge space for students to gather, as well as a designated study room. In addition, there are shared private bathrooms, which include a shower, toilet, and vanity. Alma College has houses for fraternities and sororities, as well as several apartment buildings in which students reside. The Hamilton Commons houses the Office of the Registrar, Financial Services Office, and the main dining facility for the college. The Hamilton Dining Facility offers students, faculty, and staff a myriad of dining choices, including hot foods, a deli station, a grill area for favorites such as hamburgers and grilled cheese sandwiches, a stir-fry station, and an extensive salad bar. The Stone Recreation Center includes areas for group fitness classes, indoor track, personal workout equipment, and a center court for various different activities such as volleyball, tennis, or basketball. This is an area commonly used for intramural sports. Students must use their Alma College ID and have access to everything at the center during business hours. This center provides a great location for students to maintain physical activity and reduce stress levels. The exercise room located in the Stone Recreation Center is equipped with a wide variety of different equipment pieces, weights, and areas for physical activity. The room offers a lot of equipment and substantial space that allows numerous students to use the facility at once. The gym at the Recreation Center is equipped with lots of space and different activities.